If you know the midpoint formula, then you know how to find the midpoint of a line segment given the two endpoints. But what if we know an endpoint of the line segment and the midpoint and want to find the other endpoint? This is a pretty straightforward procedure. I'll show you a couple of examples. In this example, we're given the endpoint negative 2, negative 1, and the midpoint is 3, 0. To find the other endpoint, we have to ask how much did the x-coordinate change from one endpoint to the midpoint, and how much did the y-coordinate change from one endpoint to the midpoint. In this case, the endpoint had an x-coordinate of negative 2, and the midpoint had an x-coordinate of 3. So you can see that's an increase of 5. The y-coordinate went from negative 1 to a y-coordinate of 0, which is an increase of 1. Then, to find the other endpoint, you just need to repeat this change. So go up 5 from 3, which gets us an x-coordinate of 8, and go up 1 from 0, which gives us a y-coordinate of 1. It really is that simple. Here's a picture of what's going on. This is the given endpoint. This is the given midpoint. And since it's the midpoint, all we have to do is duplicate the change between them to get to the missing endpoint, which, like we said in this case, is the point 8, 1. All right, let's try this again in a second example. In this example, the x-coordinate changes from 12 at the given endpoint to 4 at the midpoint. The y-coordinate changes from negative 4 at the given endpoint to negative 1 at the midpoint. So the x-coordinate changed by minus 8, and the y-coordinate changed by positive 3. Just repeat these changes to get the coordinates of the missing endpoint. Thus, to get the x-coordinate, we subtract an additional 8 from 4, and that gets us an x-coordinate of negative 4. And then for the y-coordinate, repeat this addition of 3 to negative 1. That gets us a y-coordinate of positive 2. And this is what it looks like as a picture. We were given this endpoint and this midpoint, and we just duplicated the change between them to get to that missing endpoint. In this case, the missing endpoint was negative 4, 2.